This is going to be a video on the OBUS test for contractures in the tensile fasciolata. The OBUS test assesses for tightness in the tensile fasciolata muscle, which is responsible for a tight iliotibial band. To perform this test, have your patient in sideline position with the lower leg in flexion at the hip and the knee for stability. Then the examiner passively abducts the upper leg and brings it into slight extension, while the other hand fixates the pelvis. In literature, this test was first described in 90 degrees of knee flexion, but we prefer to have the upper leg completely extended to have the iliotibial band and the even more stretch. Then slowly lower the upper leg all the way down to the table. This test would be positive if the upper leg stays in the air and does not fall down to the table, which is not the case here. Okay, this was our video on the OBUS test for tightness of the tensile fasciolata. I hope this video is helpful to you. If it was, give it a thumbs up and make sure to check out our other videos on the Thomas test for iliopsoas tightness or the rectus femoris contracture test right here to assess for rectus femoris contractures. See you next time, stay tuned for new videos, bye.